Hi Virgo, I'm Tanya and this is your tarot reading for March 2022. First of all, we're gonna look into the light seers to roll and we're gonna see your current energy. Queen of Cups, ooh, I love this for you, Virgo. This is amazing. Also, we've got the Magician and the Fool. Oh my God, a queen and two major arcanas. How can it get any better? And whoop, bop, bop, bop. this is too fast. For your money and career, I want to have a look into the Maruch X Oracle deck. It's specifically for money and career. It's this green deck here. And we're going to have a look what is going on for you in March. For Virgo, please. A card for money and career for Virgo, please. And we have a card for Virgo for money and career. Thank you. We've got the planner. Amazing. The planner. I mean, this is you, Virgo. Have you ever made something without a plan? I guess not. <laughs> and I must know because I'm a Leo Sun and a Virgo Ascendant. So here on Planner, we've got pay attention to detail and create a plan to grow your business and personal finances. Careers in event planning, pro project management, or professional organizing would be ideal for you. This is a great time to take a financial inventory and see what needs changing. So this is telling you to remove the expenses which are not necessary and keep everything which is needed. Maybe get a sheet of paper and just write down what are your financial goals, how much do you want to spend every month, how much do you want to keep and how much do, do you want to put aside for latest spendings like saving money for a car or something like that. Um, we've got the Queen of Cups here. So your monthly energy is that you are very in tune with your emotions. You know exactly where you are between heaven and earth. You have your connection from your base chakra to the ground and from your crown chakra to the sky and you are feeling it. So definitely, even if you close your eyes and you dream away, you can feel what's coming. You know intuitively, you have it in your guts. So also listen to your dreams. When it is about love, this is very good for experience expressing your emotions to someone else, okay? So if you didn't have the courage, this is the month where you can express yourself uh, perfectly because you just know and you are aware of your feelings. Um, also, we've got the Fool. So you might start some new projects. You might uh, take a leap of faith. So maybe you just jump into new cold waters. Even though you haven't worked in that field before, you're gonna give it a try. Or even though you don't really know what's expecting you, you're just going, you're riding into the blue and just hoping for the best. So you can see here that this person is having a lot of trust because she is uh, letting herself drop backwards and she knows intuitively that there is this safety net catching her. So you will make a leap of faith. Even though you don't know the exact outcome, you will dare to jump over this edge and just do it. Um, then we have the magician. So you're very good at manifestation in March. So whatever you think will become reality. So please keep your thoughts positive as it is a little dangerous. What you, yeah, it's a little bit the feeling of what you think is what you're going to get. So please think positive, um, even though the circumstances that you are jumping into are unknown and you don't really know what's expecting you. Expect the best, expect the most positive outcome because you are creating here. You are bringing something to life. Maybe you're writing a book, maybe you're painting pictures, maybe you are doing some artwork, maybe you sing songs and write songs. So whatever it is, you're definitely having a creative outburst because your emotion are leading you right exactly to creating what you want to create and even if there is painful emotion sometimes the most painful emotion can erupt into the, the most beautiful artwork okay so but please be aware of your finances here as it says your finances need some careful planning need some detailing maybe you do your taxes in march or whatever but you need to uh, just tend to your finances carefully let's see what is your uh, crystal that will be beneficial for you here in march let me see We've got Sagilit self-control. This stone will help you have the necessary self-control in order to not spend too much money so that you will have enough later on. So this is really good. Let's see what the dice says. The dice says your lucky sign this month is the Libra and your lucky number is the number eight. 
That's the number of Leos, by the way. So have a wonderful March. Let me know in the comments how it resonated for you. Maybe leave a like down below and subscribe to my channel and I'll see you soon. Bye.